Landon, Landon's on a roll here. Could it be that the decision erodes away the re reverence for the law and the court, or could this wake people up to how extreme things have gotten? No, I think it erodes, it, the whole process erodes the, the, the trust in the court. It, it, it is viewed now as them against us. It's no longer viewed as the subjective entity that's really trying to figure out what the truth is or what the Constitution says. It's viewed now as the conservatives always wanted to get rid of Roe versus Wade. They found their chance. It has nothing to do with the Constitution. It has to do with subjectively who was there, happened to be there at this time. Um, the leak didn't help. The fact that this document was leaked didn't help. The, gu the, the other decisions that surrounded, particularly the gun decision, didn't help because suddenly they're overturning state laws when they're just advocating for state, so-called state rights. It, it, I, think, I think the court uh, is now going to be viewed much more as a political entity than it has in the past. And, and look, I've said this before, and I still believe it, that generally the courts are still, relatively speaking, a bastion of reason as compared to legislatures and as compared to, to the executive branch. But this does definitely you know, erode the quality of our courts generally, because remember, the Supreme Court kind of dictates to the federal court system. The whole system now plays to that, those principles. And even if they're uh, judges in the system who don't agree with the Supreme Court, they don't have a choice. They have to abide by what the Supreme Court uh, decides. All right, Bonnie, rights can be enumerated because they're endless. Absolutely. They embody every human action that is not coercive. Yes. The right to life is the right to act. Our lives depend on our lives depend on reason and freedom to, and the freedom to use it. Absolutely. So you can enumerate the rights. It's meaningless. I mean, there's only one right in that sense, right? There's the right to life. Everything else is everything else that is required for your life in the fullest meaning of required for your life is you have a right to. That's it. And even the stuff that is not required for your life, even stuff that's required for your death, because we can't ban action, you have a right to. Right? So poison and committing suicide and all that stuff, you have a right to, even though it leads to death. Thank you for listening or watching the Iran Brooks Show. If you'd like to support the show, we make it as easy as possible for you to trade with me. You get value from listening. You get value from watching. Show your appreciation. You can do that by going to yourownbookshow.com slash support, by going to Patreon, subscribe star, locals, and just making a appropriate contribution uh, on any one, of those, uh, any one of those channels. Also, if you'd like to see the Your Own Book Show grow, please consider sharing our content and, of course, subscribe press that little bell button right down there on YouTube so that you get an announcement when we go live. And for you, those of you who are already subscribers and those of you who are already supporters of the show, thank you. I very much appreciate it.